Among various polar condensers, the volume perforated condensers are remarkable by their active surface. The anode is tablet like and made of tantalum powder, niobium, and aluminium. Thus, the powder is pressed and cemented, as the result of which a solid perforated body is formed, the surface of which is expanded to a maximum. After the glaze and the tablet is oxidized, electrochemically in order to form oxide coating on the grains. To produce the second phase in the cathode, the oxidized tablet is coated with manganese dioxide pyrolytically. In both cases, the anode is placed inside a leak-proof casing. The technology of producing tantalum and niobium oxide semiconducting liquid condensers are generally similar and constitute a range of specific operations, pressing, high-temperature vacuum cementing, pyrolytic manganese dioxide coating, silvering, leading, and tinning of the layer. The advantages of the volume perforated condensers are long storage life up to 25 years, high specific capacity and low reactive resistance. That is why for many years the volume perforated condensers are implied in high technology equipment despite the high cost.